Okay, I want to show you a little bit about uh, some of the tools of the trade. And what I like to do is keep all of my equipment in one Rubbermaid uh, Dutch oven container. And uh, not, specific, not specifically made for that, but of course that's what I use it for. The only thing you have to remember when you're using a, a Rubbermaid container is everything's got to be cool when you put it away. Cause your problems. Okay, some of the things that you need basically. Uh, let's start with tongs for maneuvering some of your briquettes. Got a couple of different types of tongs. This is just a basic set of uh, spoon and spatula. This little thing is great when you're taking the lid off of your Dutch oven. You need some place to set it that it's not in the charcoal. That's a great thing to have. And here's the Dutch oven. This oven is a number 10, which means it's uh, 10 inches across. And that's one of the basic sizes. 8, 10, 12, 14 are basically the oven sizes that you're going to find out there. Of course, you can get them smaller or larger depending on uh, how into this Dutch oven cooking you want to get. Then you want to have a lid lifter. There are a lot of different types of lid lifters. This one you can just set on there. You can manipulate the lid with one hand. Set it over here. Here's one that uh, one of my boys made in his shop at school. And that's kind of a fun one. I don't use it much. A little tougher for me to, to use. But uh, it does a great job. And, and I keep that around as a, as a keepsake from my boys. So that's a fun thing to have. I always like to have a whisk broom. As you're finishing up your dish, you can just whisk the briquette dust off of the top, serve right out of the Dutch oven. So that's an important thing to have. I always carry plenty of paper towels in my, my goodies and some extra garbage bags uh, that uh, just are really handy all the time. Occasionally you're going to need a good pair of leather gloves if you need to manipulate your oven. Uh, without something that you can't do with your lid lifter. The lifter can also pick up the oven. Okay. And finally I have some tin foil. And I like to use, have some salt. And we'll talk about salt and using that to help clean your oven in another section.